Hello, beautiful people. Happy Independence Day to the Nigerian people. We are here on the street of Nigeria asking Nigerians how they are celebrating the Independence Day today. We are on the street, and I have with me this morning Mr. Israel, who would be talking to us how he is celebrating the Independence Day. And I would like you all to take note of the fact that, as much as Mr. President has addressed us this morning, he has spoken to Nigeria and wish all Nigerians a happy Independence Day. Still, there are still a lot of Nigerians who are, who are taken to the streets of um, different parts of their states to protest against hardship and bad governance. So I'll hear the thoughts of Mr. Israel on this show this morning so that we will want to see insight into his perspective as regards what is expected to be celebrated in Nigeria. Good morning, Mr. Israel. How are you doing this yeah, good morning? Good morning. I'm fine. So, happy in Independence Day. So, let me ask you, how are you celebrating Independence Day? Well, Nigeria. Well, I don't even know whether I make a talk, say, you don't cast. I'll be in the back cast. I'll be in the back cast. In fact, you don't cast. What are we celebrating for? What would they celebrate? Then the thing I want. What would they celebrate? Eh? We are, we, are, we are celebrating independence, and there is nothing to be, there is nothing to be independent about in this country. Eh? Independence is an act of being free from the, 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 the rulership of other um, um, countries who are superior to, 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 to Nigeria. But look at, we are, we are, we are almost getting every of the um, 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 ideas and, 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 and permission we need from other countries, like from US, which is the world power, and some other countries. Imagine a country that is, that is celebrating independence. We are going about going billions and billions and billions of, and billions of dollars of loans. What are this money being used for? What are we, what are, what are, what, what is the happiness of the independence we are celebrating? Yeah, we are celebrating independence and we are, we are suffering insecurity in some, in, in, some, in most of the states in, in, in Nigeria. But then speaking about security, Mr. President addressed us this morning and he said they have been able to put an end to three, over 300 bandits and all of these bandits. So to some extent, according to him, he, he said they have been able to stop insecurity in the country. This is just a gimmick. It's just a way of buying people's attention. He's indulging people. See, let me tell you something. As far as I am concerned, as far as Nigeria is concerned, security, there is nothing like security in this country. A country where people, even I, I, I heard of the case that happened, very close to everyone, a man, a single, a single person killed four persons all for the purpose of money, killed three children and 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 and, and how um, 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 these people that packed that in on the streets. At the same time, you know, there is so much of insecurity in the state. We are not even, we are not even, nobody is even secure. Nobody is safe anymore. We don't even know the next one that's going to happen now. A lot of people, a lot of younger um, persons that are dab dabbling into money rituals, all forms of rituals to make money. If there is security, how can just one person take the life of more than three persons at, 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 at the go? So should we say then, should we say then that insecurity should not be seen only in the case of uh, bandits and all of that, but we should also consider some inner issues that is happening within the four corners of our community. We should also extend the angle of security to that area. Of course, like in the area of kidnapping, that then there, there, there is the highest, there, in fact, there, is, there should be more of the highest highest measure of security put in place for the for the areas of kidnapping. Kidnapping now is, is a thing that even children, um, 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 jump into. I know of a, a, a younger person, a younger student in the, in, the, in the university that that is uh, that is um, abducting fellow students and calling their parents, um, demanding for ransom. Look at how bad it has, that it has gone, and we are celebrating independence. What are we? What are we celebrating for? There is nothing to be independent about in this country. We are still under the the the, 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 the leadership of all that countries. We we are we are okay. How can we be celebrating independence and then we are running to? Other countries to beg for loans. Okay, so so let's let's look at it from this perspective because you are saying that there's nothing in that there's nothing to be independent of because we still have to depend on other, other countries. countries. Yes. I can remember that sometimes uh, this year, um, Nigeria got um, uh, rice, mess a lot of metric tons of rice from Russia, and we know that uh, is it Russian or Ukraine? Yes, Ukraine. Ukraine yes. And we know that Ukraine is currently fighting for and we have to depend on them. So, a country that is fighting war, that they even need more of these items to help um, 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 settle the to, the to settle the people who are who have been displaced by the war. They are even coming to our aid, we that we are not even at war in our own country. Eh? Getting grains of rice from a country that is at war. How does that sound to the hearing of any reasonable person? How does that sound? How can a country that is at war, not just a not just a minor, a major war? They are coming to rescue in terms of food to a country that's not as well that is relaxed. 
that has all the natural resources you can ever imagine or think of. Okay, so let me hear your thoughts on the protest that is currently ongoing in some part of Nigeria currently. Mm -hmm. What are your thoughts concerning that? Do yeah. you think it should be on a day like this, or do you think that today is the right day for people to come to the street? Today is actually the right day for people to come to the street at the best to the level that if the government does not come to to terms and agreement with whatever it is that will be the request of these people who are protesting, then I don't know. There should there, there should be total unrest because this it has gotten to a point whereby we can no longer bear it. We can no longer be suffering and smiling. We have actually been living on that on that on that um, on that um, um, angle of life before, suffering and smiling. But at this point, I think it's high time we open up and make it known to that to the government that we are not comfortable. We are not even at peace with whatever is going on right now. We need to protest. Let the protest go on. And let it should be today that is. Um, um, October 1st, which is the independence day of Nigeria. Let it happen today. I'm totally in support of the protest um, today. All right, so since you are in support of the protest happening, if you are opportunist, will you be willing to join the protest? As I am, I'm all set to step out any minute from now. If I see the, the response and turn up from other people, I will pull out with them, I will pull out with the crowd. All right. All right, thank you so much, Mr. Israel, for making us thank time you for and also me. sharing your opinion. All right, you just heard from Mr. Israel as regards his thoughts on the Independence Day and also on the protest that is currently ongoing in some parts of Nigeria currently. We'll be moving on to, um, or we'll be having other conversations um, again this morning. We'll move on to other parts of Lagos and mm -hmm. see the reactions of people as regards to the independence and also as regards to the protest that is currently ongoing. So we'll be going uh, further. So please stay tuned with us as we'll be bringing the update today. Thank you.